welcome back. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the stunning finale of Jeff Goldblum versus the Colbert Questionnaire. What's your favorite? What's your favorite action movie, Jeff? Okay, I was prepared. I, I knew that you might ask me that. Now, this is a work in progress. Um, I'm going to. I, I, can't, I'd be, I can't say one. But here are a bunch of movies. Very quickly. Is that just a tiny version of the Rubiat of Omar Khayyam? What do you, what do you have there? What is that? It's my, it's my notes. You know, I did it all through the, the world according is to Jeff shorthand? Goldblum. Is that shorthand? No, it's not. I have a doctor's and horrible scribble. No, you couldn't read that though. It's just my, it's my printing. I don't do. Um, What's it called anymore? What's that called? That my kids are learning to do. It's cursive. 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 I, I I haven't done that for a long time. You don't join your letters. No. Okay. No. Um, favorite action movie? It's one of these. Listen closely. Seven Samurai. Mm -hmm. Kill Bill. Mm -hmm. Team America. World Police. Skyfall, Casino Royale, the Daniel Craig, Goldfinger from Russia with Love, Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse, uh, Treasure of the Sierra Madre, uh -huh. a French Connection, Apocalypse Now, Lawrence of Arabia, Isle of Dogs, No Country for Old Men, uh, Jurassic Park, Rio Bravo, One-Eyed Jacks, Bullet, Jaws, Badlands, uh, Blade Runner 2017, Dune 2021, Bonnie and Clyde, Raiders of the Lost Ark, or Mad Max Fury Road? 25. Really? It's a 25? That's 25. Wow, Nicely you're done. like Rain Man. Nicely done. I didn't know how to... I have fingers. So what... Uh, really? So one of those... I don't know. Anyway, that's my answer. I don't know one of those will be... All right. You know, pick, pick one. Okay, favorite smell. Oh, I, have, I have a few. Very, very quickly. Uh, <laughs> Fresh air, the loamy, loamy earth, mm. rain. My kids, I got a six-year-old and a four-year-old boy. Just to pick one, their hair, their hair. And then Emily, I think her neck, right there, right, right wow. there. Wow, You had three of the elements. You had air. Fire, you had, fire. You had, you, had, you had earth, you had uh, uh, water, yes. and then you were about to go for fire. Fire, fire what's fire smell like? Well, fire, oh, fire can smell delightful. A nice, cozy fire, depending on the logs, that's a great smell. <laughs> depending on the logs, depending on the logs is a great modifier to every sentence. <laughs> Depending on the logs, this when you could read, be good. When you read the fortune cookie, you just end it with depending on, on the logs. logs. And it exactly. All makes sense. Or mm -hmm. the, the, a new album by Earth, Wind, and Fire, how that smells when you first take it out. Oh, yeah. A delicious smell. Most used app on your phone. Uh, here's the truth. Uh, I appreciate the navigation app because uh, I was never good at the maps or my, you know, that's very helpful. But the most used is. Um, Two of them, Google, I, I, I think it's amazing that we can go, what's, the, what's another word for, you know, da, da 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 I can look up a thesaurus there. I can look up everything. It's fantastic. Instead of going to the library, which sure. was great. Also, YouTube. You can see an old, you know, clip of uh, Thelonious Monk uh, or, or a comedian that we like, London Lee or something. What's the last thing you looked up? What last video you looked up to, to watch on YouTube? I'll tell you, I was listening to things today. I'm kind of a little bit in a cycle down a rabbit hole with shows, podcasts with physicists. I've been Ooh, listening. Have to... you ever watched Richard Feynman's lectures on uh, on YouTube? Fantastic. No. Really? Fantastic. Really? Yeah, yeah. I, I dig. Aren't they great? Isn't it yeah. great that you can get that? Yeah. It's fantastic. I will tell you what my last one was. Thanks for asking. My last one was. <laughs> Uh, I looked up uh, Antonio Gades. I'm sure I'm saying his name wrong. He's a great flamenco dancer. Oh. And I bet, I bet you've attempted flamenco. You've got the body for it. Thank you. Thank long, you. Long. It's that long, lean thing. Uh, yeah. Thank yeah. you. Him dancing the Faruka. Check it out. The okay. Faruka. All right. If I changed my name, it might be Faruka Goldblum. <laughs> Cats or dogs? Well, I tell you, well, I've already told you, the, um, we did an episode of the first five that are coming out of the World Coin Jeff Goldblum on dogs. And we have, who, who appears in it, our personal dog right now, Woody, our family dog, mm -hmm. Woody is in it. Uh, I'm totally in love with dogs. And I've had dogs throughout my life, even though I had a couple of cats for a while, and there's nothing wrong with cats. They're delightful. <laughs> 
But, uh, but, but do, you know, if I had to pick, I'd say I'm a doggy, doggy man. Okay. You only get, you only get one song to listen to for the rest of your life. What is it? A very, as you know, very difficult question. Um, uh, uh, because I, I, I'm a guy, if I, even though there are songs that affect me, have affected me tremendously, and I put them on the thing, once I choose it and listen to it, I get kind of out of steam with it very quickly. I would rather, if it's my, if I had my druthers, I would put on the radio, a good radio station or have somebody curate or surprise me. I like surprise. So I wouldn't, I'd like not to choose. But if I had to, there have been, <laughs> there have been songs uh, that I've gone through cycles with. Mm -hmm. The two that come to mind are when I was, oh boy, 13, when it first came out on a 45, I had Stevie Wonder doing uh, For Once in My Life. You know that recording with that solo that he's got. It drove me absolutely crazy and I played it over and over and over again. Then there was a time recently where Errol Garner <laughs> plays uh, El Dorado. Have you ever heard him play El Dorado? Oh, it's great. You can see it on YouTube. Oh, and I played that over and over again. It's great. So that tickled me. So those two, if I had to pick something. One of those two. Yeah, I guess. What number am I thinking of? Uh, oh, that's easy. 4,128. I did it. I don't know how. I'm getting chills. Describe the rest of your life in five words. Oh, that's a tough one. When you're hot, you're hot. When you're not, you're not. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, I got it. I got it. All you need is love. <laughs> Jeff Goldblum, congratulations. You are known. I'm known utterly. My thanks again to Jeff Goldblum. Season two of The World According to Jeff Goldblum is available now on Disney+. We'll be right back with a tribute to Stephen Sondheim.